Welcome to day four of the Make an iPhone Game of 30 Day Challenge here at Illusion. Okay, what I've got to show you today, I've finally cracked open the Developing in Cocoa Guide. A um, couple chapters into that. Um, going well so far. Still making programs for Mac itself and not for the actual iPhone. Um, obviously need to spend some time get myself you know, familiar with what I'm doing as I'm four days in so far. Um, what I have done though is done some concepts for the actual game. I know what I'm going to be making now. Best to come up with an idea at this stage to stick to it. At which point I can find out what exactly I need to learn from this point out. The game is going to be a puzzle game slash simulator. Slightly ambitious for my first project, but why not? Set the bar high, see where you go. Um, it's also going to be anime themed. Um, the characters are all going to be um, anime drawn professionally. Um, again, quite ambitious for our first game, but we're going to see where we can go with this. I've drawn up some concepts of the characters. As a theoretical title screen, or poster up, um, and um, smoothie people you can play in the game. And so on. And a simple uh, uh, kind of game map of different things you do. Um, you got your title screen, main screen, and you've got like a character manager. Um, and from that, you can choose what you want to do with that character if you want to go into the main puzzle game. Um, and there's you can get experience and so on, you can choose your ability. As you're probably thinking as I go through this, you are stepping way too deep for your first game. But what the hell. I'm going to give it a go. Um, same time limit. I've sent them off to be the art at least to be done from a person I use for my PC games, which I no normally knock up in Mighty Mini Fusion and not the programming language. Um, but that's, I've got nothing to show for today apart from that. Um, Apart from I'm, I've done more of both books, making map programs, still haven't touched anything on the iPhone side yet apart from getting applications onto the phone and testing I've got the licenses to do so and access to the portal and so on. Okay, that's all for day four. Um, and I'll get back to you soon.